Hey everybody, Kevin Sylvester here. Instead of a written column this week, we thought we'd go the video route. Lift, clean, and place. Let's start with the lift. Well, lifting is what Brooks Kepka is known for, but that's going to go away. He's now going to be known for being a major. That's right, a major champion. Four times out of the last eight majors, he has come away the champion. Back-to-back -back U.S. Opens, back-to-back -back PGA Championships. Just incredible. Now, I think it's fair to say Brooks had played with a chip on his shoulder for not being regarded as one of the best players in the PGA Tour. Matter of fact, you go into majors, except for this one, most people would not pick Brooks Kepka. I think from now on, people are going to pick Brooks Kepka until he shows that he's either not going to win a major or not finish second. Think about it. He finished second at the Masters. The guy is on an incredible run. I think one of the biggest reasons is he doesn't win a lot of PGA Tour events. He's won two. The Phoenix Open in 2015, CJ Cup in 2018. When he starts doing that, maybe more people will take notice. But then again, he's won four majors. I think everybody's taking notice and will continue to take notice of Brooks Kepka. When it comes to clean, that's what I use to describe the look of Oak Hill for this week's Senior PGA Championship at the Fame Course in Rochester, the East Course. West Course, by the way, is pretty darn good, too, uh, at Oak Hill. I had a chance to get up there on Monday. The place looks spectacular, ready for a major on the Champions Tour. And some big names are certainly going to be there. Bernhard Langer, VJ Singh, all competing. John Daly going to be there. If you haven't made plans to go out, make sure you get a chance to go to Oak Hill. It's a treat just to be there and walk around the place. The history of U.S. Opens, Ryder Cups, U.S. Amateurs, PGA Championships. It's great to have that jewel in western New York and just a short ride from Buffalo. But, of course, if you're in Rochester, an even shorter ride. I'm looking forward to getting out there on the weekend at Oak Hill. Maybe I'll see you out there. I'm going to go back to Beth Page Black as the place. They're going to get test a Ryder Cup there in a few years. And boy, is that place going to be nuts. I mean, fans in New York are never shy to express their opinions, to chant, to cheer, eh, maybe taunt uh, a little bit there. But man, what a Ryder Cup that's going to be at Beth Page Black. What a fantastic golf course. And really uh, a great achievement that it is a public golf course, a municipal golf course. It's a state park, so New York residents can go and play it. Again, you got to sleep in the car and all those things, but to get access to a course like that for under 100 bucks for a round of golf, that is incredible, and what a great gem we have in New York State. Another great place I want to tell you about is Sweeten's Cove in South Pittsburgh, Tennessee. Now, I haven't been there, but I want you to listen to the podcast and the TD Green podcast page with Mark Rivers. He's a Western New York native who is in real estate development and has put together a pretty awesome ownership team. I'm not going to tell you who's on the ownership team. I'll let him tell you when you listen to the podcast. But it's only a nine-hole golf course, but it looks outstanding. It receives a ton of awards. No real frills about it right now, but I can't wait to go there and play there later this year. Sweetens Cove in South Pittsburgh, Tennessee. And by the way, if you have any questions or comments, be sure to send them to us at the TD Green team. Best way, send them to my email address, kevin at tdgreen.golf. And if you are a member, great. If you're not a member of the TD Green Club, make sure you sign up. We give away all sorts of great stuff, and there's going to be some special offers coming up as we continue to build the club here. We're just an infant uh, right now, but we have some uh, plans and ideas that we want to put forth in the future with the TD Green Club. So make sure you sign up at tdgreen.golf. It is free, and you'll thank me later when you're a winner or you take part in some of the cool things we have planned. Thanks.